Hello, my darling ladies. Do's and don'ts for dating a married man. I've made other videos on this subject. I have never dated a married man. I never will date a married man. But if this video can just help one young woman, one lady to realize nothing to gain, everything to lose by dating a married man, I will be happy. So do's and don'ts, my ladies. Do. Do give him a time limit. How long are you willing to wait? Because there are some women out there who have been waiting five and 10, even 20 years for their boyfriend who is married to leave his wife. So how long are you willing to wait? My suggestion is three months. Three months, anyone can get anything done. He loves you. He wants to be with you. He wants to leave his wife. He can do it in three months. He can do it in three days, actually, because you just go home and tell your wife, I don't love you anymore. I'm sorry. It's over. I want a divorce. But let's give him maximum three months. And you tell him this. You tell him, darling, I'm not waiting a whole lifetime. I love you. You say you love me. You have to you know, get your act together. You want us to be together. I'm not waiting more than three months. He knows he has a deadline now. He has a deadline. You're not going to wait forever. So let him know that. That's a do. Don't. Don't. Listen to any excuses. The children are young. I want to wait till they grow up. No, the children are better off with our mommy and daddy, you know, hollering and screaming and arguing. Okay, they're not arguing. But they're not kissing. They're not hugging. There's no love shared between them. So the children see that. So they're better off. I'm from divorced parents. I'm so glad my mom got a divorce and I didn't see her crying and being sad because my dad was treating her bad. No. She raised me on her own and <laughs> that's the best thing to do. So children are not an excuse. Property, property together is not an excuse. I mean, we all know Harrison Ford, no? Gorgeous movie star. He was married over 30 years. His wife was um, co-founder of his um, movie company. So when he divorced her to marry Calissa Flockhart, he had to give her over $50 million. He did it. He got a divorce and he is married now to Calissa Flockhart. Because I'm sure that's what she demanded, marriage. So the children, property, um, financial problems that they have, or maybe... They even say, oh, you know, their wife isn't doing well right now. Um, you know, he doesn't want to hurt her right now. He doesn't want to leave her. Well, he's eventually going to leave her if he says he loves you and he wants to have a life with you. So now or later, what's the difference? So those aren't excuses. So do give him a time limit, limit, my darling ladies. Do not wait forever. Do not wait forever. A time limit. And if he doesn't do it within those three months, it's over. Break it up. Because if it's not happening in three months, why do you think it's going to happen in six months or a year or two years? Maybe five years have passed and you're still waiting for him to leave his wife. No. They either do it within three months, two or three months, or it's not going to happen. Time limit, my darling. Do keep your life. Keep your life. I, I've seen not friends because I don't really have any friends who are dating uh, married men, but I do know women who are dating married men. And they build their whole life around him. He's their whole life waiting for his call, waiting for him to be available, waiting for him to sneak out from his wife, waiting for those raw, precious moments, hours, maybe days so they can be together. And their life has stopped. They don't go out with their girlfriends anymore. They don't date anymore. They just sit around 
waiting for him. No, do not do that, ladies. He has a life. He has a life with you, fun, adventurous. He has a life with his wife. They're going out. They're doing things together. He's not just sitting on the couch every day with his wife. No wife would accept that. They're doing things together. And he's going out with his friends, male and female. He is having a life while you are waiting for him to give you a life. No. Keep your life, my darling ladies. Keep your life. Do not stop seeing men. Okay. You don't have sex with men. Well, I don't believe in sex unless you're in a relationship. Um, my videos are keep the cookie in the jar. Dating doesn't mean sex. So go out with men. Okay, you don't have sex with them, but go out with them. He has a wife that he uh, is sleeping with, is living with. Okay, he tells you he's not having sex with her. Okay, let's believe that. He's not having sex with her, but he's sleeping with her. He's not sleeping on the couch or in the guest room every night. No wife would stand for that, no? So he's sleeping with her. You go out with men. And you know what? You might even meet someone that you like. So keep your life. Don't just, you know, hang out waiting for his phone calls and just waiting for him to take you out. You go out. Enjoy life. Have a good time. Go out with your girlfriends. Go out with your male friends. Have a life. Okay, my ladies. Let's ask him why he doesn't love his wife anymore. Why, you know, why is he uh, cheating on her with you? What happened? What happened to this marriage? These are the questions you need to find out. My darling ladies, find out as much as you can about the wife. Tell him to show you a picture of her, because you may be surprised. She may be beautiful, hot, sexy, maybe may be younger than you. See who that woman is, and please do not hate her. She's done nothing to you. She's a victim. Whether, you know, she's a good wife or a bad wife, she's still a victim. He's cheating on her with you. So find out, you know, what you can about her. And the reason he's cheating on her, because she's boring, she's not sexy, she's not, you know, dressing beautifully. He comes home now, he says, oh, you know, she's always in her jogging, you know, no makeup. Well, that's going to be you too when you live together, when you get married. You're going to be home with your, you know, jogging and no makeup. You're going to be boring sometimes too. So see the reasons, you know, he's cheating on his wife. Because they may not be valued reasons. And those reasons may be the same ones he's going to use on you. So be careful. See why he doesn't like the wife anymore. Okay, if he says, I know she doesn't love me anymore, I go to hug her and kiss her, she walks away, she looks uncomfortable. I do not, you know, I am not, I don't agree with you know, married man cheating, but that's the only excuse that is valid. Not, you know, she's not sexy, she's not fun, she's boring. Those aren't valid excuses. So do find out as much as you can about the wife. See her picture at least. And don't hate the wife. Okay, here's a surprise that a lot of married men, no, a lot of women who date married men don't realize. He likes it just the way it is. He likes being married. He likes going home to his wife. He likes being in a couple with his wife. And he likes dating you. He enjoys the situation. He has no intention of ever leaving his wife. He likes it just the way it is. His wife, that woman who's known him 5, 10, 15 years, mother of his children, who he feels comfortable with. He likes being with her. He just doesn't love her anymore or find her interesting anymore. But he doesn't want to leave her. He found you. He has fun now with you. Good times, fun, laughing, drinking. Great sex with you, but she's his rock, and he has no intention of leaving her. So remember that, ladies. Are you sure he really wants to leave his wife for you? I wouldn't be so sure. Nothing to gain, everything to lose. I hope at least one lady, after watching this video, would say, hmm, I think I'm going to end this relationship. He's never going to leave his wife. Or, okay, I'm going to give him the ultimatum. Three months, 
Your marriage is over and you're with me or it's over. Write in the comments, my darling ladies, why you are with this married man. Let, you know, share with other women who are dating married men. Give me a thumbs up, share with your friends, and subscribe. And thank you if, if you have already subscribed. Mwah! Ciao for now. You are a beautiful woman. I'm sure there's a man out there who will love you. Have your high self-esteem. Know your value. Okay. Give that married man three months. And that's it, ladies. Mwah!